Hello everyone! So as you all know by now, I use Charlotte Beauty from Perfect Shades Cosmetics Skincare range and today I'm actually going to show you their makeup too and how amazing it covers. I use the makeup range as well. So I'm not going to focus too much on the eyes and the blushes and the highlighters and the eyebrows and all of that. I'm just going to show you how I prime my face, how I apply my corrector, how I apply my foundation, how I set the makeup with the powder so that you can do it at home too. And it's really easy. I'm going to post a picture as well of the finished look. Then you can see how I did my eyes, how my blush looks, and I will also show you the palettes that I use to do it too. And all of these products from highlighters, from eyeshadow palettes, from blushes, lipsticks, eyebrow pencils, eyeliners, everything, they are all available at Charlotte Beauty from Perfect Shades Cosmetics. Okay, so what you are going to do first is okay let me just start off by saying i already completed my morning skincare routine of course so now because it's daytime i need to apply the spf 50 photoshop primer it looks like this okay so i'm just going to apply a pea size maybe even smaller than a pea size because you don't need that much and I'm going to apply it on my face. So of course SPF 50, so it protects your skin from the sun. It also gives you a smoother and more matte um, surface to apply the foundation. And it makes it last much longer too. I'm just gonna look away at times because I have a little mirror here that I can see properly what I do. <laughs> All right, so that is that. Going into the neck as well. Never forget about your neck. Okay, so that's done. Okay, now you are going to use your corrector. So the corrector is a little bit of a darker color to your foundation. So this you will put on wherever you feel that you need more coverage. So specifically me, I have quite dark circles under my eyes. It used to be much worse, but thank goodness for the skincare range, it's not. So... I apply under my eyes and I still have some acne scarring but as you can see and also compared to my previous videos and pictures it has lightened a lot so I'm just gonna apply it once again just look at the mirror I'm just gonna apply my corrector under my eyes let me just come closer so that you can see it's a little bit darker than my actual shade so if you need to know if you don't know oh, what color corrector you need, what color foundation you need, please contact them. You can visit them at their store or they can do an online consultation for you. And they are very accurate and they match the best, color, best colors for you. Okay, so you can now see I did it on my eyelid and under the eyes. And then I have a few spots, acne scarring, so I'm just going to add the corrector there as well so yes there's no specific area you specifically need to put on the um corrector you put it on where you feel you need more coverage so all the darker spots like pigmentation dark circles wherever you want more coverage you put the corrector sorry i just dropped my brush but it's okay so then i'm going to use my foundation from Shiloh Beauty as well. So my corrector color is called color latte. So and then my foundation color is color ivory. So then you're going to take your brush as well, your application brush. Okay. And you're just going to apply all over your face now. <laughs> and I really I really just use minimal product. It looks so much, but it's really not I literally just wipe it and put it on my skin okay yes you do this everywhere on your face please go down to your go down your neck as well preferably to your collarbone because you also do not want your foundation to look like a mask on your face you want everything to blend in quite well okay so that's done so now this is 
how it's going to look. It looks a little bit crazy now, but I promise you the finished look is going to look amazing. So then I have my foundation brush. Oh, all of these brushes are available at Charlotte Beauty as well, which is amazing. It's literally what I love about this brand as well. The things tapping motion, sorry, tapping motion. The thing is, everything you need for your makeup, you can get it there at Charlotte Beauty from Perfect Shades Cosmetics. So it's your one stop to get everything you need. So you just tap, 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 just tapping motion, that's all. So you can literally look flawless within 10 minutes. <laughs> all right, so it's really quick, it's really easy, it's not difficult to apply the foundation and the corrector. I know with many other brands that I've used before, you need to apply and apply and apply and apply just to get the coverage you need. But with this corrector and foundation, it does it all. I don't reapply, reapply makeup until or foundation until I feel okay. Now I have enough coverage. This gives me enough coverage coverage after one application. So also the foundation is cruelty free. It's hypoallergenic and non comedogenic. It has anti inflammatory and anti aging added and full coverage five times more um, coverage than your normal foundation lasts up to 24 hours so it's just amazing it doesn't rub off it doesn't transfer it doesn't oxidize it just stays the same color the whole day and I mean look at this let me come closer to show you I mean this is coverage you see this is coverage so a lot of people likes they like this dewy look so what you can do, you can just take your foundation brush and just brush a little bit of the powder over your, over your foundation. But I like the more matte finish, so I am going to put some of the powder in the lid. My powder is powder number 7. They can match your color powder for you as well. And I'm going to take this powder puff. Let me show you. There we go. I'm just going to dip it in there and just put it all over my face. I'm just looking into the mirror again. Yes. So I'm putting it all over. All over, all over, all over. Don't forget about your neck because you did put foundation in your neck as well. So you need to set it. So I just put everywhere. Okay. Then it looks like this. So then you are going to take your powder brush again and just brush it brush it through spread it nicely over the skin I also just lightly dab it into the powder again as I brush as I brush it down and across my face like that okay and down the neck so this would be your finished look and if you want to do some of um, the contouring you can do so and you can apply your blushes and your eyebrows and your eyeshadows but I'm not going to do that right now I'm going to do it after this video and then I will post a picture of the finished look so this is how it looks now I have a piece of paper here um, my face is actually going to move because I want to show you the pressure that I put on you see, I'm, I'm putting pressure on. My whole cheek is moving. And look. It did not transfer. Okay? So, it really stays on. It stays on. It's just like a splash test. You never know. It can suddenly rain and you need to run to your car or run outside quickly to get something. And it can rain and you don't have an umbrella. And it's just going, oh no, my makeup. So, let's just do a splash test on the one side of my face. Because then I'm going to compare the two sides. <gasps> okay, it's on my cheek. I don't know if you can see on the camera. Let me do some more raindrops. Pretend raindrops. Okay. I have quite a few. Yes, you can see. I've got a few drops there. So I'm just going to tap it off. 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 Nothing. You can literally just see the water that it took off. The water drops, splashes, the play, play rain. Okay, so 
it's still on still looks the same waterproof doesn't transfer it's amazing so stay tuned for the finished look bye